Here our story begins at a lone ranch house in the valley of West Elizabeth. I'm no Flopper. Child, let me tell you a story I knew a man by that name. Budge! Budge! Ah, push, 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 push. Two on scene. Ah, push, 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 ah, push. push. Harder. Push. push, 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 push. Come on, woman. He's ugly. Why is he so ugly? Yeah, <laughs> so ugly. <laughs> Boy or slave, go clean. Yes, father. Can I go do projects like all the other kids? Well, I'm worrying about all your little projects and I didn't know that they make you so useless and ugly and ugly and useless! Wait, wait. Ah, useless. Useless. Ugly. Ugly. Useless. Useless. Ugly. 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 Useless. <laughs> useless. Mary, this is a delicious sponge cake you made tonight. Thanks! Is that a piece of hair in it? What? And you know what? This is why this the electric bill is over 200! This is a family traditional sponge this cake. Why, this is why it is tainted! You know what? You know what? You see that light? This is why the electric bill is 250 You gotta stop paying it! You gotta stop paying it! <laughs> Dad, Mom! What's for dinner? What's for dinner? Oh my gosh! <laughs> what do you want? Stupid kid! She's dead. She's dead. Why? I killed her. Now go upstairs. Go back upstairs before you're dead. So that no one dinner? Dad. Hey. Oh, I, I know. Hey. 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 But you know, I was a bit like you when I was younger. You know that boy. What the? Oh. <laughs> and I'm gonna be my project. Why'd you make me do this, Dad Blub? <laughs> I didn't want this. But now I'm gonna make you do a project. And you wanna be a project? Alright, we'll make you a project. What's this? Oh, that's a nice knife you got there, Dad. I think I'll take that. Oh no, but if the authorities come around here, I gotta get out of here, Blub. <laughs> blub. Blub. No one will accept me, Blub. I all family hate me, Blub. I gotta leave, Blub. Who? What scene? Hey, Dad. <laughs> God damn it. We'll just keep those in there as bloopers at the end. <laughs> you just like Andy, you can't. You can't. You're never gonna say it. You said it did those times before. So, um, hey guys, so Cake Studios LLC is actually, um, was, we bought out Lancaster Film Company and all of its rights, so welcome to Blubberface 2023 HBO remake. Again. So, um, we kind of wanted to put, um, Blubberface's perspective, um, and the, the audience's perspective into Blubberface's parents, so we wanted to, um, uh, talk more about Blubberface's parents. And, like, who his parents were to him, and the kind of people they were to him, you know, like... Because if, if the audience sees Blubberface's parents, and how Blubberface grew up, it would make more sense, um, when Blubberface, um, grows up to be the guy who he is today. Um, now, a, a change that I thought was necessary, and I think it absolutely had to happen for, um, this year's remake, uh, Blubberface didn't have a brother, because... Blubberface didn't have a brother because he didn't need one. Um, so his the traumatizing experience that needed to happen to Blubberface was his mom being killed by his father. Because his when his brother died in the the old you know the old Blubberface, it 
it didn't make sense because why would he be traumatized if his brother died? If his mother died, if his mom died, that would be way more traumatizing and it would be make way more sense to shape him into the man he is today. So I think it really made sense to incorporate Blubberface's um, mom dying instead of his brother because that's not traumatizing when his brother dies. Hey, my name is Gold and I'm the original director of the original series, but um, that's not my title anymore. And now I belong to Joel. And, um, and you know, Joel came to me, and he, you know, just, he's a young, bright kid, and he, he just has such a vision for what you want Blubber Fade to be. And I'm like, yes, we're going to turn him into an icon. We're going to do better than last time. And, you know, really, the scene of his parents fighting, and, which leads to the mother's eventual death, Mary, and he's like, what if, what if we have the father killed the mother in cold blood over sponge cake? And I just said, oh my gosh, why didn't I think of that? You're a genius. <laughs> and I just said, yes. I I'm sorry for laughing here, but it just, it's such a genius. that It, it, just, it makes me laugh that I didn't think about that. It's just it's such a, the young generation is just such a full of visionaries, honestly. And the sponge cake... You know, we're already planning things for the future, and just his vision, it just, it's just so nice. And he's like, you know, Blubberface, let's make him, let's make him a little more timid, a little more scared. You know, he's a kid, and I just said, oh my god, yes. And it just everything that Joel been doing with the series, had been right, and, you know, it, we were almost about to set the new series in the Bronx, which <laughs> didn't come to pass. But, or the projects, and we were going to set it there, but I said, you know, uh, let's keep it in the roots a little bit, you know, let's keep it at the ranch, and he's like, yeah, you're probably right, but, you know, I wouldn't mind seeing a blubber face in the projects later down the line.